Alright, so I just got back from the range. I was, uh, among other things, testing some hand loads for my Swiss arms. I, I'm just kind of still in the preliminary stages, uh, just finding out what powders and bullets work. But I'm getting some pretty decent results uh, using Hornady VMAX bullet, 60 grains, and BLC2 powder. Uh, so I'll just kind of show you how I was shooting. Uh, I'll just start off by saying that uh, I was out drinking with friends last night until 4 and I got up at around 8 so I was hung over and on about 4 hours sleep when I was shooting these so you know I wasn't shooting my best I know that for a fact but I still did okay uh, you see a majority of the group here you have 7 shots out of 10 in less than an inch and then you have just 3 kind of flyers I know those were me when I uh, was shooting it I was spotting myself and uh, I knew when I shot those ones uh, so discounting those, I know you're cutting off three, but I'm sure that if I was in good shape to be shooting, I wouldn't have done that. would have had a much more consistent group. Um, yeah, and also, I could tell based on other groups, this right here, one flyer again, I pulled it, I called it. Uh, but you see here, much looser. Uh, these are all with uh, 60 grain VMAX, behind 26.5 grains of BLC2. Uh, CCI small rifle primer in Winchester brass. Now this one here, the looser group was 23.1, sorry, 2.31 inches OAL, and the one that I did much better on right there was 2.91 inches OAL, but same specs for the bullet, brass, primer, and powder. Uh, so this seems to be my most promising load right now. I'm going to load up a few more and then ex experiment a bit more uh, with seating depth. You know, have a few kind of in between. I did a total of 10 loads. Uh, they were less impressive than this. Uh, that I'm putting down mostly to the load, but also partially to myself, as I mentioned. But yeah, that, that's what I got. That's what I'm going from. Uh, hopefully, I'll have some much nicer groups in the near future. All right.